service is such a big part of Pepperdine's mission. We are all ingrained with focusing on ourselves, and so through service, we can think of others first. Service has, has played a critical role in defining who I've become and, and what's important to me, not only now, but throughout the rest of my life. After I graduate, I don't want to work and live for myself, but I would rather do something meaningful and that provides service for other people. Our students are committed to service. They come to Pepperdine recognizing that Pepperdine wants them to be involved in service and is committed as an institution and as an organization itself. Service has been my constant at Pepperdine. I've always been able to find an opportunity to plug in and give back and be grounded in that way. I hear story after story from students of how Project Serve impacts them in, in very unique ways in their lives. I don't think you can go into an experience like Project Serve and not have your life changed in some way. I don't know what type of impact I will have and I have a funny feeling that I'll be more impacted than they will be. One of our principles is serve, don't help. And Pepperdine has fully embraced that principle. So it's just great to see the students from Pepperdine really like stepping up and taking on a heart of service to serve with orphanage outreach. Today when I like met the kids, I think that's when I felt like, oh, okay, I know why I'm here now. The entire class was sitting there with anticipation, waiting to hear what we were going to do and very excited to learn. We're both working so hard to kind of figure out exactly what the other person is trying to say. And when that moment comes where they start to smile and you start to smile because you both know that you understand each other, it's like that aha moment. Luz here has been my little shadow today. It's been kind of nice, actually. We've been playing all different kinds of games. We were playing in the trees and running around, and she would hold my hand the whole time. While we are doing a lot of teaching, half of our days have been really about manual labor and digging ditches and building bunk beds and just making the orphanage run really smoothly. And surprisingly, everyone has just jumped in and there's no complaining and they're just doing what needs to be done and really serving with their hearts. I think both the service aspect, building, as well as seeing the kids and interacting with kids definitely is teaching me what it means to be a servant. It was just really awesome to see some of the local kids want to also help in what we're doing. We did things little by little and we worked on projects that maybe we didn't feel made a huge impact, but I know that every single little thing we do is just a building block. While you're working, it doesn't seem like nothing will ever get done, but at the end of the day, you look at it, you see that it, you've actually made an impact or made a little change to the place. I think that's what makes it meaningful more than anything. I was so impressed with their hearts because these are students that want to continue helping people in their jobs and their vocations. I think that this experience opens people's eyes and it really doesn't allow you to, to be blind to what the world is like to most people anymore. You know, when those blinders get lifted, you're so motivated and so dedicated and so needed to give back because not everyone gets to see things like this. I think it's definitely something I'm going to take with me after I graduate. Just the things I'm learning, the aspect of service, it's going to be part of me, definitely be part of me when I decide what career to choose. My faith has really been strengthened here because the past year or so, I feel like God has been tugging my heart towards missionary work. I'm just really proud to be a part of Project Serve because it is so universal and so many Seaver students are touching lives this week. It's just been absolutely wonderful to see the work and impact that Pepperdine has had and will continue to have.